Hello guys, welcome back to the Elm Creek series. Um, I think I think Avery's moving. Yeah, that's what he told me. So, I'm gonna go down to Avery's house, and I think we're leaving today. So yeah. Oh, there's cattle. Just not power steering out. Yeah, this way's quicker. right here. Good fucking driving, you see. Great driving, isn't it? Okay, you guys selling your trucks or not? Yeah, I am. Yeah. I just want to make sure you give it. pulling by right now to pick it up. I'm surprised someone... Gave me the check for it. I'm surprised someone would buy that. Grabs I giant sledgehammer. I'll just put a giant dent in the side that. of mine. Well, it wasn't worth much more. It was starting to rust. The frame was about to rust through, so. Alright. Alright, look, I got mine. Mm. Alright. Are we taking all these tractors up here? No. Well, get in. Somebody needs to get in with me. Hello. Well. I'd like you to use it, dude, because you can just go take everything out of the house. Make sure the fuel tanks are empty and put oh, everything yeah. inside the... Tube. I'll just top all the tractors on the side of the road. Or, I'll just use the combine to empty out them. Right. It's, it's at about half a tank, so... I got a plan, Ethan. Okay. We're gonna redneck rig some shit, you just watch. Alright. You just gotta stand back and watch. Okay, so I'm assuming we're gonna get like some, like like three semis and load everything down on, the, on like Not three, semis, three semis, two semis, a singular mm, semi. One semi and one 50 foot gooseneck. So I'm bringing my truck. Oof. Okay. Well. Because we're not taking everything. No. Yeah. Avery, I'm just gonna go ahead and top everything off with fuel. Okay. Top in the semi and get the uh, things unfolded. Alright. Wait. Nope, 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 Here. Unstrap these. Then you get the dirt. Strap. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. There you go. Oh, okay.
think Blake left his truck here. Yeah. Or did he? St I thought he sold it with his house, didn't he? Yeah, he sold mm. it with his house. Is what he told me, and then he just got, and then he rented a truck to drive there. Okay, I gotta take a phone call. <clears throat> yeah. I had to stop on the interstate. Couldn't stop on the highway or anything. Uh -uh. Okay. So, Kettle, how's that going? Pretty decent. I thought you were taking a phone call. I am. Hold on, I gotta find the number real quick. How are you talking to Kettle? Through my handheld TV. I thought I thought you were on the phone. I have both of them. You got my just doesn't want to drive. Everything's filled up with fuel. Hey, Ethan, just get an Uber down here. I already know what's happening. Okay. I can fix it. Okay, God, I got everything set up pretty nice. Me and Cattle got it. Okay. How did Cattle even get down there? I ran. You ran with Hmm. We both ran. I didn't know Cattle could run. Faster than you can. That's for damn sure. I wondered where Avery's donuts went. Ethan. Hmm. Did you eat Avery's donuts? No, Kettle. Yeah, okay, I got hungry. <laughs> I want to do an oil change on the, uh, on the, um, what's it called? I can think of it. In the 8910. What are you gonna do to it? An oil change. For what? Making sure. We just put an oil change in it five days ago and we put like three five hours Five months ago. On it. Still, we've only put like three hours on it since. Well, I'm bored and I have nothing to do. How is that grapple not broke yet? Buddy, that's not a safe idea on the grapple. Fucking dumbass. It was mainly resting on the bucket. There we go. Grapple. So are we taking the combine or not? I figured we'd probably just leave it here. Yeah, yeah, I'm a little heavy. What are we all? We gotta take the 3010, so I gotta go. One's a 3010 and one's a 3020. We gotta bring the 8R. The 8R's gonna come. Um, Hold on, we're taking the duels off of it if we're loading it up. Yeah. Okay. Go get your toolbox. Yeah, I will. Hold on. Gotta bring the, uh, the 8 or T. Yeah, but it's got the extended on it. I don't know if we can. Oh, yeah, true. Probably bring the 8410 instead, then I like the 8410. There you go. Got your little tool card right here. I'm gonna bring the 8910. Alright. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'll go get this tool off. There we go. I'm assuming we're just probably gonna leave these two extra tires here. What about the 33? Oh, this. Yeah, we'll take both of them. Okay. Ethan, get in the one without the loader. I'll put this one up front. Okay. Avery, do you want it backed on or pulled on? Uh, pull it on. Okay. 
Actually, I better not do that. That's gonna end bad. Actually, let's put the 8410 on first. Or is that what we're keeping? Yeah, pretty sure. Cattle. What about the sky groove that's staying? Yeah, probably. We're taking the Ostromers or the Magnum? Let's bring the Ostromers. I like to take the Magnum too. Yeah, I like to bring both. We're redneck rigging it. Okay. I got her to the front and I'm just gonna rescue a bucket on the front. Hey, Kyle, can you guide me up a little bit? See, can't really see. See if you can get the Alice on. Keep coming. Go. There, oh, there we go. I'll put the Alice on. Actually, here. No, we'll put the this on that. Got the bucket. And then put the Alice on the summer. Mm hmm If we do the right amount of rigging, we could probably fit both. The Alice is coming. The 8410 and then the 8R. I'm gonna guess back this up on the front platform or just the back tire? Yeah. Here's a bit of the can up there. I know the whole thing won't fit, but at least the back tire. Yeah, I'll start throwing straps on. There we go. Yeah. Keep, keep coming. Whoa, cattle. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I can get it over. Don't want to pull it off. Cattle, cattle, get out of it before you flip it. I can flip it. <laughs> mm -mm. Can you get her down in the lowest gear possible for this. You're not going back up on there. I am. Look, first try. No struggles. Well, I hit it with the wrong gear. Oh, I'm sure you did. I had her in medium range, not well. Ethan, guide me back. You, did, you, you don't have to be guided. You just go straight Thank back you. and take the front weights. Not that hard. Well, no, God, you don't that have doesn't to have front weights on it. All you have to do is just turn around and look. Not that hard. When I was on the 3020, I had that whole tractor. I had that whole tractor in front of me. I couldn't really see in front of it. Don't care. You couldn't turn around either. What? There we go. Okay. All right. Who are, are you we? bringing the old POS work truck? Yeah. Okay, I'll drive it since it's the least of our worries. You shouldn't trust me with this. <laughs> I feel like Ethan could drive the little service truck. That's true. Yeah. Alright, Ethan, you could drive the shit box when it gets up here. Okay. What am I taking? The semi. Okay. Okay, who's leading the way? Avery? Yeah. Who's going last? Okay. I feel like Ethan should go last just to keep us behind. Because I have a feeling I could be have a one hell we'll I have could... one hell of a convoy going. I'm not even gonna attempt to go through that bridge. Neither am I. I'll go through the bridge. <laughs> Ooh, that's rough going down that. Come on, watch. I highly doubt you could have got through it with YZ to Avery. That's not exactly what Go, Kettle.
Ethan, how we doing behind? Pretty good. Before we get going on the interstate, I want to check tires. Yeah, I'm going to check tires and everything. Pull over. Let's see. Yes, we did load some power steering fluid. I'm going to check power steering because I don't have much steering. Okay, that's good. Checking these straps. They're good. Okay. Avery just replaced these tires a couple months ago, so they should be alright. Yeah, but I still want to check them. These ones should be okay. I know the inner ones might be a problem. Okay, I want to pour some power steering fluid in. No, I just got this goose neck, so it should be fine. Okay, just a second. I want to pour some power steering fluid in. Okay, we're good. This turn up here pretty slow. Yeah, I was planning on it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. What, Avery, did you see a rough spot that I need to go around? Yeah, pretty much. Pothole. Yeah. I yeah, just I didn't realize how heavy this load was. Mm -hmm. Come on, old Bobo. You can get your seat. I could give you a little push cattle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Probably wouldn't be the greatest idea. Probably not. Oh crap, that's rough. Yeah. Wait a second, I want to back out of that, Ethan. Okay. That is like really rough. I'm just gonna turn my hazards on. Yeah. Probably stay out of the fast lane then, cattle. That's true. Oh, and we're just getting off over here, so we should, probably shouldn't be in the fast lane anyway. Come on, Kettle. Alright, Kettle, I'm going around you. I don't know what you're doing. Thank you, Ethan. Your camera's dying, isn't it? Yep. Okay, guys, so I'm going to end the video. Make sure you come back in whatever map we're on next. Goodbye.